Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Please subscribe below if you have not already and give me a thumbs up if you enjoy this video. Okay, so I did a few videos on um, products from Miss Jessie's line. I did honey curls, I did pillow soft curls, and quick curls. So a lot of you ask me which one I prefer. Usually they ask if I like the honey curls or the pillow soft curls. So I thought, and then sometimes I'm like, I don't know the correct answer because some days are better than other days. Um, you know, it just really depends. So I thought, let's just take a day and do a side by side. Now I have three of them, so I'm only gonna be able to choose two. I'm gonna do the ones that I'm mostly asked for, asked my opinion on, which is the honey and the pillow soft curls. So I was thinking there's so many other curly hair products from Miss Jessie like this that I'm going to maybe do another video on that and then eventually we'll just like keep doing a side by side, whoever wins that side, then at the end competes for the final win. I don't know. We'll do a side by side. We'll see. But I thought I would do that. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to try this side by side. And my hair is like in true summertime humidity state. Like, I don't think I've really shown you guys because when I started YouTube, I've always gotten keratin. I know I repeat myself a lot with the keratin, but this is really the first summer I'm on video using hair products without a keratin treatment. So, um, if you have my hair, you'll see how these products work because, and I don't, I really need a good, not a haircut. I don't want to get a haircut, but with the quarantine and lockdown, I haven't had like a good cleanup. I always call it a cleanup. I need a cleanup, like the thinning out. I know some people said, don't thin it out. Your hair looks great full, but I just, I think cause in the summertime when it's full, the thinning out helps a little with the frizz and it's just so big. My hair just feels too big sometimes, like, and not in a good way big. I like big hair, I just don't like big frizzy hair, like when my hair is like just a big mess. Um, so this is it. This is like truly my full, my real hair without treatments of chemicals, whatever, keratin. And we'll see how these products work because it's been like humid out. These, And this is like one of the hottest weeks I think so far. So. Uh, we'll have to see which one lasts better throughout the day. Um, I don't know. I like them all. I really do. So, And I'm really excited to try other ones from Miss Jessie's line because there's so many. It's like fun. I want to have my own little collection. So today again, I'm going to try the Pillow Soft Curls and the Honey Curls. And we're going to see which one we like better. The Honey Curls is Sweet Almond Oil and Honey. So this is... Um, to do honey curls to a perfect consistency to be spreadably smooth for maximum coverage without any greasy buildup. All of these products from Miss Jessie have no sulfates, parabens, silicones, etc., etc., mineral oil, um, all that stuff that you guys don't like in your hair. Um, so this is really good. So, oh, it says in the top, oh, you know what's interesting? Because I'm like, what really is the difference? If you look up here, they all have like a different thing. This says super definition, this says fluffy curls. And the quick curl says, uh, fast, no fuss, and frizz free. Natural honey hole, super soft. Okay, so we're gonna give this one a try next time with other products. So this will be like uh, part one of the side by side of Miss Jessie's. And you know, if your hair is different than mine, another product, you know, maybe it will work a little different on your hair, but we'll see. Okay, I think I'm gonna do pillow on this side and honey on this side. Don't know why, just what I picked, so that's what we're gonna do. Oh, I just realized I have to have a middle part today. It's okay, I haven't had a middle part in so long. Okay, I'm gonna go in with the pillow soft curls now on this side. So that'll be my left side. Okay. Oh, this smells good, it's like baby powdery. Just putting a little more in. Okay. 
Okay, one side is done. Now I'm gonna go in with my honey curls on this side. I'm gonna wipe my hands a little first so that there's no cheating. It's like honey. a little more. Okay, both products are in. Okay, let's get trying. Okay guys, hair is styled, hair is dried. We got pillow soft curls and we got honey curls. Which one? I don't know. I like them both. I just they look the same to me. I don't know. Like I don't feel a difference. If anything, the the scent is definitely different. They're both good. This is a little high. I always have this side higher because I usually do side part. That I can't help. So it's not because of the product that I have like more volume here. It's just my hair's trained. This section is trained to go that way. So it's kind of more fuller. But other than that, my hair looks really good. And just a side note, if you guys watch, have been watching my videos, the last, I don't know, a month, I've been like throwing my head upside down at the end and I'm stopping that. I'm stopping that because I realized, I don't know why I was doing that once the humid weather started because that just makes my hair more frizzy. I don't know why I was doing that. I, that's why I stopped doing that years ago because I realized, yes, it makes my hair fuller, but right now that's not what I want because, I don't know, with the, with the weather and everything, so no more upside down for me. Not until the winter at least, or the fall. But, um... Also, I did do an Olaplex. Olap I did do an Olaplex treatment the other day because I did some coloring to my hair and I felt like it was a little too much. Some bleaching, um, highlighting, as you know, and I just wanted to give my hair a little treatment. My hair looks so much better. It wasn't looking that great throughout the week, and again, I said it on my last video due to hormones, which have now moved on. It's like. All of a sudden, poof, my hair's back to normal. So it's just weird how that works. So if, if it's that time for you of the month and you're like, my hair looks terrible, this product stinks, don't throw it away just yet. Try it when you're out of that week. Trust me. I mean, I don't know if it works for you, but for me, my hair is just not good that time. So it is what it is. Um, and it's, it's the... It's like the PMSing stage. That's when my hair is the worst. Anyway, sorry guys if you're listening. So, um, yeah, I like both of these. I don't know. I really do. I can't decide which is better. Can you decide? Do you think one is better than the other? Because I literally don't see a difference. They both look really good. My, def They're both defined. Um, yeah. And I was looking at this. I, I'm, I'm going to put this in there also so you guys could have read it. But um, the Honey Curls is good for wash and go styling, coils and braids, twists, natural styling, short crops, rod sets, conditioning hold, and defining curls. The Pillow Soft Curls is for wash and go, a fluffy soft curl for people who don't want ramen noodle definition and instead want a larger expanded curl. I think that's hysterical. I love that. Ramen noodle, that's exactly what I don't want. So, yeah. Okay, um, let's just go on with the day, see how it goes. I'm going to my sister-in-law's later. I'm probably not going to bring the camera, but um, we're all going to just go over there. 
even though it's only a Tuesday night, but why not? And um, yeah, that's it. I really don't have that much to do, but you know, hang around and we'll see which one lasted the longest and which one looked the best at the end of the day. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so um, I literally just finished filming. I'm um, using the other camera, that's why it looks a little weird, and the lighting is like really strong with this camera. Like you don't need this lighting when I use this camera. But I thought I would just show you a little behind the scene here um, of the mess that you don't see when I'm filming. So just so you know, I wanted to also film a little TikTok video, which is a little different. I had to do it on my phone because of the, you know, it's just a different um, dimensions, whatever you want to call it. So. This is my big mess to clean up. Lights all on top of, oh, I should have left my phone here. I didn't leave my phone. My phone was connected here. My phone was up here. All on top of the fact that I still have to work. Yes, so I'm gonna get to cleaning up this mess and um, what I really should do, but I don't feel like doing it. So obviously I have a lot of hair products that I collect and I needed a place for them. So I have this great shelving that I borrowed from my daughter. I, not borrowed, I took from my daughter's room. She didn't need it anymore. So I might, I don't wanna do it, but I have to organize. I had them all organized, but now they're kind of a mess. This is where I keep all these hair products that I have. And yeah, I wanna organize them how I used to have them, like, like maybe a favorites, gels, um, gels, creams, the tubs, like the butters and stuff, um, masks. Yeah, I have, I have to really get this organized again. So I might work on that. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah. Oh, hello. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So I might do that. Um, yeah. And we'll see. I, you know, I bought this and I haven't used it yet curl mask. I just feel like, I don't know that curl masks really do much for my hair. I don't know why. I have a lot of stuff here. Oh, this is a big tub. Yeah, that one I definitely want to try. I haven't tried that yet either. I have a lot of things that I want to try, but um, yeah. All right. You've seen me try all these pretty much. These are all products that I have done videos on. So yeah. Maybe I'll do that. We'll see. But I do like the way my hair looks. I do, both sides. So this is a hard one. This might be um, a tie, but I'm gonna let you guys decide. I'll see you later. Hey guys, so it's the next day. I apologize. I did not, I was not able to get on last night to show how my hair came out. Um, something came up and I just, I couldn't film. And, and on top of that, I was outside and I had, I, the bugs were coming out at night. I put my hair back in. If you have hair like me, you know, once you put your hair back, like in a low ponytail, the curls are gone. Like it's just the way it is. And I screw that up. But again, I don't think I would have been able honestly to get on anyway. Um, so I did it again today. I, I literally did the exact same thing. I put the honey curls here, pull us off curls here. And um, I will tell you, my hair looked great. Um, it really, really did. My hair looked both sides. It's almost, it was a tie for me until I got to, you know, again, I couldn't, when I came home, I just, my hair wasn't, um, I mean, when I went to bed, my hair just, the curls were out. So it was hard to tell. So I did it again and uh, it's still a tie. Like, I don't know, but I know that I have to pick one. So, um, cause I want to, at the end of the day, see which is my favorite, Miss Jessie's. So we'll see. I mean, so far, again, they both to me look great. If I had to choose though, I would choose not so much of how my hair came out because again, I think they both look the same, but I would probably, but I would probably choose maybe the Pillow Soft Curls because I love the smell and I like the feel of it when putting it in. Like the honey curls is great, but it's literally like almost like honey. Like, you know, not that it's annoying sticky, but I like the smoothness of the pillow soft. Not to say I don't like honey curls though. I'm not saying that, but if I had to choose, but we're not there yet. I'll try to remember. No, 
I will remember. I will come back in later this evening at the end of the day and we'll see how it went. But again, I think both sides are good. Um, yeah, so I'll catch with you in a bit. So I just wanted to show you something kind of cool. Um, if you follow me, you know my mom passed a couple months ago. And so we were going through her stuff. My mother never wore jewelry, like, ever. She wore her wedding ring, that was about it. Um, she didn't even have her ears pierced, she wore clip-ons. And so I didn't think she really had a, any jewelry, but I guess over the years my dad maybe got her stuff. And she just put it away, which is so sad, she never wore it. So we were going through it, my sister and our daughters, all her stuff. and so many jewelry pieces I'm gonna show you so we put it all out I should have filmed that day because I had it all out maybe another day I'll film but I just want to show you this quickly this is we each took what we liked and um, I still have to send to my other niece actually but we took what we liked and this is just my one daughter's she laid it all out so I'm like oh I should show this it's just so cool because it's almost like um, vintage you know some of it I mean, it's, some of it's real, like it's gold and everything. Um, and some, I think, I don't even know. I think it's just like costume jewelry, but let me just show you some of the stuff. It's kind of cool. So like, my mom was, I don't know, she was born in 1932. So like, they've been married for so long, my parents, 50, over 50 years. But just to show you, like, this is like, this is all going way back, all this jewelry. Her name is Anna. I mean, isn't this just like, so pretty, all these things? Like, some of the things, like, I don't know that I would wear it now, but knowing that, like, it came, she had so many watches like this. So many watches like these. It reminds me of, like, Mad Men, because I noticed that, like, Betty always had these watches on, so we each actually got a watch if not and i have to get them fixed they don't work but if i take it and get a battery i don't know but it just looks pretty it's very like you know how this was the style back then so we each got some of these some brooches i mean it's just amazing this is only a handful just a handful of what she had and again this was i think not as old because i think i got her that in like the 90s <laughs> but some of the stuff I'm going way back to like the 60s even I don't know this is nothing actually compared to what she had nothing but maybe one day I'll show you um, I'll show you some of the other stuff this I'm actually wearing I this was also from her this was also hers I just love it's dainty and I love that it's from you know it's from my mom and it's also it's not from my mom it was my mom's and it's just going way back and it's not a new piece I just love it I really do so I'll be wearing that a lot um it's like a little Mary uh, I can't think of the word what do you call those I can't think of the word but yeah so I'll be wearing that. but there's so much I couldn't believe it. and it's like I wish she had known that I wish she went over that with us so that she can just in so she can just enjoy, you know, giving it out to her grand girl, grandchildren and all that. But whatever. She, like, hid everything, my mother. <laughs> she hid everything. Um, yeah. So I thought that was cute just to show you. But again, I will take, because I have my pile and I just haven't even gone through it yet. Um, but I'll lay it out like my daughter did and I'll show you. Maybe I'll do it later for this video. If I remember. Okay. I do have a follow-up doctor's appointment to go to, so... I am actually getting out. <laughs> okay, and then I'm gonna go food shopping. Not that you care, but I'll see you later. Hey guys, okay, it's, um, I'm not going to bed quite yet. It's just after dinner, but I am gonna call it a night because I do wanna <laughs> put my hair up. And uh, yeah, so I guess I have to make a decision. And this, I have to admit, I didn't style my hair that great today with the diffuser. I kinda like rushed it. And um, that's why it doesn't look so great. Like it looked so much better yesterday, you see that? It looks it looks good, but I know there's better potential. And I'll tell you, sometimes with the diffuser, if you hold it a certain way, for me at least, I get this. So I gotta always be careful that when I scrunch it, I don't do that. I gotta try and like scrunch it like so that the curls, <sighs> everyday problems, huh? So silly for me to worry about that. But 
Um, I think both products are just as good. I gotta be honest with you, the results, it, again, this just doesn't look as great. My, uh, my diffusing skills today weren't that great, I guess, but, um, if I have to pick one, because I'm going to pick one, I'm, I'm gonna go with the Pillow Soft Curls, for the reasons I said before, just that it, I like the, it's silly, it has nothing to do with which one looks better, it's just I like the smell of it, because I have to pick one, so that's the one I'm gonna go with. So that's it guys and we'll follow up with more products from this Jessie challenges. So that's it. I hope you have a good night um, and enjoy the rest of your week and until next time guys have a good day. Bye.